Hello, I'm Charles Melton, and I'm here with Wired Autocomplete Interview. Yes. <laughs> Who is Charles Melton, a Korean American currently in San Francisco who loves sports, especially football, who's in a movie called The Sun is Also a Star that he's very proud of. Military kid, army brat, third culture, loves kimchi, loves Korean barbecue. I could talk about myself all day, but I'm not going to. Who does Charles Melton play in Riverdale? Easy, Raging Mantle. Who did Charles Melton play in Glee? His name was Gavin. 45 seconds, episode five, season five, New York, New York. 43 minutes in, you'll see me for 45 seconds, so don't take a bathroom break, but that's me. Who is Charles Melton dating? My girlfriend. And what kind of question is that, people? Adam, bring me the next one. Charles Melton, what's a fun fact about me? I can do the Smeagol voice, Gollum from The Lord of the Rings. Okay. Stupid, stupid hobbits. <coughs> oh, Lilo and Stitch, too, since we're on a roll right now. Uh, Ohana. Ohana means family. And family means nobody that's left behind. Okay. When did Charles Melton graduate? I graduated high school in 2009. Does Charles Melton speak? Does Charles Melton speak in Korean? Yeah. 그래. 나 한국말 말해. 조금 말해. 그래. 나 한국말 조금 말해요. Does Charles Melton speak in Korean? <laughs> Can Charles Melton? Sing in my upcoming film, The Sun is Also a Star. I do sing Crimson and Clover. And in Korean karaoke, my number one song to sing is Halo by Beyonce. Everything I need and more. Charles Melton in Ariana Grande. Charles Melton in Ariana Grande video. Is that a statement or is that a question? Yes, I'm in the Ariana Grande music video. What? Give me the next board. Sorry, I'm starting to get like. <laughs> Kind of aggressive, but I'm just kidding, guys. How tall is Charles Melton? All right, well, Wikipedia says I'm 5'11". That's not true. I'm six and a half feet tall. So I round up. I'm 6'1". How did Charles Melton become famous? It all started back in Manhattan, Kansas, the Little Apple. I was an all-star football player two years in a row. Uh, the population of my hometown is about 70,000 now. All state, both ways, all Centennial League, all Flint Hills. That's when I made it. How to get Charles Melton hair. <laughs> Don't shampoo and condition. Sweat in your hair. Just messy, mess with it. People are trying to figure out my hair secrets. Is Charles Melton. I get it. I know what you mean. What is Charles Melton's nationality? Well, my mother's Korean. She's South Korean. I'm first generation on my mom's side. And my dad is American. He's Caucasian, but ancestry dates back to uh, mm -hmm. Is Charles Melton vegan? No, I'm not. I had a delicious steak the other day. Is Charles Melton a dancer? <sighs> Finally. I can dance. I can dance. What? No, I don't need music to dance. Okay. That's all I got for right now. Is Charles Melton leaving Riverdale? No, I'm not leaving Riverdale. The fans are the best fans in the world. I wouldn't be where I am right now in this moment if it wasn't for Riverdale. I'm very grateful for that. Where does Charles Melton live? Well, I live in Vancouver nine months out of the year because that's where we film uh, Riverdale. And when I'm not living there, I'm living in Los Angeles, California on I'm not gonna tell you. Where did Charles Melton go to college? Kansas State University. I played football for Coach Bill Snyder. If you ever meet anybody that says they're a fan of college football and they don't know who Bill Snyder is, then they're straight up lying to you. Where was Charles Melton born? I was born in Juneau, Alaska. My dad was at the Gulf War 
in 91. And it was my mother's first year in America. She's never been. My father got her a one-way ticket to Juneau, Alaska with his uh, mom, three sisters that she's never met, and spent, lived with them for a year. I spent my summers up into the eighth grade, up into 15, in Juneau, Alaska. We'd see like kill wells and humpback wells, and yeah, Alaska's really beautiful in the summertime. Where did Charles Melton live in Kentucky? Military base in Kentucky, in Kentucky called Fort Campbell. Thank you so much for listening and bearing with me and letting me share with you a few moments. I had a lot of fun doing this, and uh, have a great day.